morning all it's half seven in the morning um on the 30th of december i'm uh at the allotment today to do a bit of work uh wife's just dropped us off it's a bit dark at the minute hence i've got the the lights on in the shed um but i've got the kettle on um and i'm gonna have a, a quick sandwich before i start um, I'll have to wait till the light gets up a little bit, so I'll uh, I'll sit and read my book for a bit, and I'll uh, I'll show you what I'm doing when the light comes up. See you in a bit. Right, more than all, light's just starting to come up, so I'll show you what I've been up to. So I've been working in the new shed or the new greenhouse. Still a bit dark in here. Got the raised beds in along this side, and then you can see. Look at all the the shaven in and raised beds below, all the way around. A bit of a shelf up there. Yeah, got all the the shaven in all the way along. So today's job is this little bit here. So this bit here is going to be um, a little mini core frame type greenhouse inside. And then today we'll be tackling this bit, another raised bed and a little bench putting in. See how far we'll get. I'm even starting to fill in some of these these gaps along here. Depends how long we saw lasts. I really want to get on the roof and do uh, all the joints, but as you can see, it's frozen. Right, catch you later. Afternoon all. It's three o'clock. Um, I've been here since half seven this morning, so I'll show you what I've been up to. First of all, Kettle's boiling, sort that first. Cut that. Right, right, let's show you what I've been doing. Well, this is down by the way, the glass house here. I'll show you the plot in a minute. It's not much happening. So, like I said earlier, I've got all the, the benches in and the raised beds on the bottom, just ready to fill up. I've, uh, I've got to get some leaf board for that. The big raised bed is there. Started with the potting bench and this raised bed, so it'll be roughly where the door goes um, to the edge of that little pallet there. That little, so it's going to be roughly that wide, um, all the way up to the, to the top. Um, so I'm not sure whether it'll be made with wrinkly tin, same as that one. Um, I'm not sure whether to cut it short, same length as the potting bench, or keep it a little bit longer and make my potting bench a little bit longer. I'm not sure yet. I'll, I'll see how that goes. Um, but yeah, it'll go right up to the fence, up to that line there. Um, I can't do too much in this area here because of the fig tree. Um, I suppose I could extend the bed right up to there, just have it small. In fact, I might do that. All these bits, the slats have still got to be covered, but I've been concentrating on um, the other bits because um, they'll use all the, the scrappy little bits of wood that I've got left. Uh, off the pallets. I've just moved the pallets uh, into there, built this this area here um, 
the bit under there is just going to be for storage, bulk storage. Um, get, I've got underneath there there's um, a path made with um, bricks. So what I'll do, I'll get my um, my metal bins, which I keep my compost, my perlite and stuff in there. That'll all store in there. Um, this area here is going to be for pots and stuff. Um, I've got some bread trays and stuff, which I'm going to use as shelving. Um, so that'll all be uh, pots and um, all the stuff, you know, all the big pots up there and all the, all the little pots in there. Um, so that area here is going to be a sink or a wash area. I might, I might, I might even put the wash area there, you know. Tell us what you think. Wash area next to the potting bench. Would that be handy? I might do that. Um, this is the seed area. Greenhouse within a greenhouse. Um, hopefully, I can um, I can seal it all up. That's just the bits where it goes up against the windows to do. But I, I might just get some. Um, you know, uh, some cardboard tubing or something like that to, to fill that. Um, might, you know, if, if needs be, I can put like a little candle heater in here just to keep the temperature up. It's sealed right up at the top. But yeah, double glaze both sides. Well, all three sides. But yeah, that's my little greenhouse within a greenhouse. Um, this is coming down. It's it is the um, you know the trellis for my for my raspberries, but um it's uh, it looks odd now it looks in the way so that's coming down. My raspberries will stay. I'll find some other way of um, of supporting them. Um, I've got loads of of this um, tent tubing, which I, I've got for a bend for to make hoops for my raised beds. Uh, but I might do something, something in here with that. Be creative. Uh, this raised bed is is full now uh, with um, just rubbish, you know, the raspberry cuttings and, and and stuff like that. I've just got it. I'm using it as a bench at the minute. Um, all my other wood and stuff. Um, I've got, you know, all the scrap wood. I've I've moved to the other shed for burning because I haven't got a, a, a fire in this this shed. Not yet, anyway. So yeah, cracking on. That old trees need stringing up. Um, I'll get that sorted. Uh, I've got some hooks and I've got the wire, so I need to redo them. I probably need a spalier this one down and across now. I think um, this one. I'm not sure whether I've lost it. I don't see any shoots on it. The other ones are, are wooden, but if it comes out, it comes out. I'll, you know, I'll put something else there. I've got a red current actually, I may put in there. Um, but I'm, I'm hopefully going to have um, these bench, these these racking to that height as well. So, say the height of the chair there, um, and it'll be brought forward so it'll be, be staged um, again. So, I've got more space for my chilies and stuff and um, more wrapping for my chilies um right let's have a look outside apple trees are sprouting nothing on the pear yet nothing on the spartan apple so the yeah lilies they're coming up Starting to get some of the daffodils come up. Strawberries need sorting, the whole lot needs sorting to be honest. It's, it's a bit of a mess. I've not had a chance for doing the other stuff. But I don't know if you notice, I don't know, you can see over there. I've got roses.
30th of December. Got Rose's button. What's going on? <laughs> and I've actually got one in flower over there. Apart from that, there's nothing else happening really. Sprouting broccoli, still sprouting. More bits coming after a cut from a Christmas dinner. Garlic is up. This is the elephant garlic. This one is door cut. Elephant garlic, just starting to sprout in that one. And onions, they're all up. Just normal white onions. All the rest looking a bit sad. Some Japanese onions, there's a few in there. As you can tell it's quite frosty at the minute. These, believe it or not, are broad beans. I don't know if you can see, the ground is solid. Right. This is all just rubbish to sort. I've lost a, a pane of glass and uh, that blew over in the winds, so I've, I've lost that double glazed unit. Um, so that'll just be going to the tip. Uh, not that I've got a, a use for it, but I think I've uh, used everything I needed. So. That's going to be it for the day. I've got a, a grape there. Got that for Christmas. So that's going to go in here. Um, probably in that corner somewhere uh, and trailed up, up and over. Right, we'll catch you later. Right, that's me sorted. Off home now for a hot bath. See you on the next one.